welcome back to Fred in the Shed 1 and today I want to show you something that is really pretty cool. Now this trick is incredibly easy to do just with one condition and I'll get back to that at the end. So I think this trick works best if you pick just possibly one member of your audience and you give hand of nut and bolt, you know, let them have a look at it, let them play with it, let them sort of undo the nut from the threads and sort of put it back on. You know, there's no, there's no worries here. It just looks like an ordinary sort of nut and bolt. And then, you know, perhaps when they're finished with it, get them to sort of place it on the table. Once they've done that, well then you can pick it up and now the magic begins because when you hold the nut and bolt, the nut miraculously unscrews itself from the thread and it drops down into the palm of your hand. And you can do this trick over and over again and it will work every time to the amazement of your audience the nut will just unscrew itself and fall off and this is such a cool trick but it's now time to stop that background music and let me show and explain how the trick works right okay as you're watching this you'll notice there's a component I didn't show you at the beginning and that is this brass collar this comes with the nut and bolt kit now, to expose the trick, what you do is you slide this collar over the threaded part and push it right up to the head of the bolt. Then you get the nut, you then thread that up to the bolt and start to put pressure on the collar. And as you tighten this, just watch what happens to the head of the bolt. <laughs> it pops off and here reveals the trick because inside the head of the bolt itself is a very tiny little watch battery cell. And this powers a small magnetic little rotating motor that's built into the shaft of the bolt. And you also get a very, very small neoprone magnet with a little bit of adhesive on it and that sticks to your finger. And when you offer that up to the bolt, the motor starts to turn, it vibrates and the nut comes off. Now, do you remember at the beginning, I said this was an easy trick with one condition. Well, here is that condition. You see, the bolt makes a small vibrating noise. Have a listen. And you know, that, that's the only downside to this trick. It's not a trick that you can perform in a very sort of quiet room. It's probably best to do it, say, at a party or something where you've got background noise, people talking. And if possible, you know, sort of take a step back away from your audience, which will help disguise the noise sort of even more. It's not particularly loud, but it would be heard in a, in a quiet environment. So there you go, something a little bit different on Freddy in the Shed 1, and I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give the old video the thumbs up. That helps me, and that helps the channel. I'll leave a link to this magic trick from eBay in the description. But as now, as always, I'd like to say thanks for your view time. Stay safe, and of course, I'll catch you all on the next one.